Hello, this is Loop Coop 6778 here, and this is a uh, small video I made. And I will not be talking very much or anything to this whole video, really. I will be doing more of that on part two. Alexander Nesterov, a junior research assistant at the Pole 21 Polar Station, is due at coordinates 86 degrees 21 north, 74 degrees 57 east, on the 27th of March 1981, where he will board the nuclear icebreaker North Wind.
How is it going? The cans are in place. No sign yet. Sit down. Warm up while it burns. I've brought two more crates to dry. Sit down. Warm up while it burns.
Through the door and up the stairs, quickly! It won't hold much longer! Captain, the rod shows formation of sea ice all along our course. The rod, as in the divining rod? Another clairvoyant gadget of yours. Sir, clairvoyance is for shamans. This is cutting-edge scientific equipment, virtually foolproof. Do you know why it is called the rod? Well, yeah, you had it, sir. Named after a divining rod, a stick used to search for water underground was real popular back in the days of wooden ships and navigating under the stars. Times change, but some things remain much the same. The ship must respect you. You must listen to her, understand her, talk to her, live with her one-on-one -on -one for many years. Then you become more than just a captain. You become a part of something bigger. That's great, but isn't it just pretty words? Sir, it seems to me all you've got to do is hold on to the wheel. When are you going to let me try, by the way? You don't waste any time, do you? Well, if you're keen, try this for now. <laughs> 